Urban Ladder and Pepper Free entered the unorganized furniture and home decor market during the 2012-13 period. However, Urban Ladder lost the plot for several reasons including challenges in supply chain management, poor quality among others. Urban Ladder had raised over rupees 770 crore or 105 million dollars from the likes of Steadview, Sequoia Capital, Safe Partners and Kalaari Capital. Reliance Retail has now bought 96% majority stake in the 8-year-old e-furniture marketplace Urban Ladder for rupees 182 crore or 24.4 million dollars. Reliance stated that it intends to invest a further rupees 750 million by December 2023, which will take the shareholding in the company to 100%. India's furniture industry is projected to double to over $61 billion by 2023, according to industry sources. Experts believe that IKEA's entry has dried up the investors' confidence in the segment. With the acquisition of Urban Ladder, Pepper Free is the only independent large player in the online furniture segment. Pepper Free recently raised a $40 million round led by Pedilite at a valuation over $460 million. Deal indicates that Reliance is making a broader push into e-commerce as it prepares to take on giants like Amazon and Flipkart. Earlier this year, in March, Reliance Retail acquires 100% stake in Shri Cannon Departmental Store for Rs 152.5 crore. In August, Reliance had acquired a majority stake of 60% in NetMeds for a Rs 620 crore cash deal. On October 25th, Amazon won an interim order against Reliance Industries Rs 24,713 crore deal to buy the retail business of Future Group after a Singapore-based single-judge arbitration panel put the deal on hold. Deal would have helped Reliance almost double its footprint as India's largest retailer.